At 1249, the CAFE CDT845 is an entry set of features, but should you compare it to the Miele G5000 series, the KitchenAid's Better M series, or the Bosch Crystal Drive, in this video, you'll learn the basic advantage of the CAFE, including the one important feature their competition doesn't have, and the one missing feature to this dishwasher the others do have. Let's get started. First of all, this dishwasher loads well. It has a basic third rack for silverware, along with an adjustable top rack like the others in this price range. The tines in the bottom rack, however, fold down so you can fit that odd-shaped platter or tray. Only Miele has a similar loading rack in their better models. Their ultra wash employs 90 wash jets on a reversing bottom rack and an odd shaped middle wash on as well. So it covers more of the dishwasher, at least in theory. The top, however, is just a spray head like a Bosch, not a full arm like KitchenAid or Miele. The cafe has another silverware rack on the bottom with dedicated sprays to clean even the dirtiest silverware. Cafe does have four dedicated bottle wash with direct water feeds to spray the residue from your sports or baby bottles. They also have a dedicated steam setting to loosen baked on dishes in addition to all the main cycles and 12 options. Customization is also possible with your choice of copper, brass, or stainless handles, along with all the colors available in the cafe line, white, black, stainless series as well. The drying is interesting insofar as it is the opposite of the industry's more effective drying modes. Meal Clean Dry and KitchenAid's Pro Dry introduce the outside air into the dishwasher so the warmer, steamier air has attracted the colder outside air and has dissipated as water. A number of brands automatically pop open as well to release excess heat and steam. Cafe does the opposite. It has the heating element to dry, but also a fan to pull the steamier air outside the dishwasher. They claim it dries plastics even faster. Cafe's 45 decibels or one decibel above the 44 decibel quietness threshold, so you will hear it faintly in an open kitchen. 45 is not bad when you consider Cafe as a grinder in the bottom, where all the others employ just a filter to trap leftovers or whatever you leave on your dishes. At this price range, all the competitions between 42 and 44 decibels, including the Profile series, which is also in the GE lineup, with a grinder at 42 decibels. As you saw earlier in the video, the wash on the top is just a sprinkle like the Bosch, but you do have the better Savoir basket with the dedicated sprays, unlike all the others. At 1279, you have an interesting dishwasher considered. 45 decibel will be slightly noisier than KitchenAid, Bosch, and Miele, and even their own profile series. However, their washing, drying, and racking are at least comparable to their high-end competition. You do have some worthwhile options. Steam so up, you loosen up the tough stains, and you can fit that odd shape dish in the bottom rack along with direct sprays for your silverware. You'll also be able to wash the gunk from the bottom of your larger sports bottles as well without rewashing. Gaffey is also available, which may be the best feature for any dishwasher or brand mentioned on this list. Click the link to download our free dishwasher buying guide. Fortunately, we all know somebody who's been talked into buying the wrong dishwasher. Don't let that happen to you. Almost 1 million people have found the right answers in the Yale Guide. Thanks for watching.